What's up guys, and today we got the Night Guardian Lamar Jackson, 77 overall, no chemistry boost uh, whatsoever, 90 speed, that's really the main selling point obviously for most people, 71 throw short, 68 mid, 62 deep throw, 86 throw power, but that's really about it. I know he has an 81 juke and everything, but that's just nothing, you know, that exciting anyways. But um, I was prepared to go into this review thinking he's going to miss all these throws, he's going to be terrible, he's going to, you know, I'm going to throw the ball 30 times so he'll have like 3 completions. That's, you know, what I went into it thinking. A little surprising about how well he actually played. He actually <laughs> those some decent passes. Now these right here, these little short passes, he didn't have any bad short passes. But um, even these, I know 71 throws short is kind of low, but I didn't see any bad short passes. Now the mid throw, this is where I assumed he was gonna just be ridiculously awful. But I mean, he he was hitting the he was throwing these pretty decent passes. I mean, I I was shocked. I'm I was prepared to call him garbage, but I mean. Look at these passes. I mean, I, I don't. I was kind of blown away with how accurate he was throwing these passes. Now, I'm not going to go on the record and say he was great, but I mean, these are ridiculous. And these are the deep throw passes with the 86 throw power. I think it was what 62 uh, deep throw, and yet, I mean, he was putting it where it needed to be. Um, I think with the deep throws, he hit like four or five successfully, and only like two or three bad, which is not that great. But st still, considering what I thought he was going to be, the overall uh, pocket pocket throwing was not as bad as I thought it was going to be and these are the, the uh, bad throws the what I was talking about he reminded me so much in my which is a bit surprising of of uh, Michael Vick not scrambling wise but throwing the ball was like he was like these right here are the passes that I was talking about you know these passes that were just like you know the ones I thought that I was going to see more regularly but I didn't um, honestly he um, like these passes right here like that was like the one bad short though, even though I threw a high pass, but still. But anyways, remind me a lot of Vic, as in, you know, mobile and everything. He'll hit some nice passes, but it's those ones, you know, here and there that'll get away from you. Now, of course, you need to slide. I know it's tempting, you know, 90 speed and everything, you know, you get in the open field, you want to juke and, you know, just uh, one cut everybody, but don't. Because he fumbled three times for me, and that's just, honestly, it's, it's going to happen. Throwing on the run. This is, you know, I think he's like what 76 throw on the run, and he only threw it uh, three times on the run, and he hit all of them. So it's like I said, I mean, I know it's not a huge sample size, but still, I mean, considering what I expected going into it, and this, of course, with your 90 speed, the scrambling ability, like I said, you need to slide because if you don't, you take a hit, there's a good chance he's gonna fumble that ball and it's gonna just throw the whole game off. So overall, man, I'm a little confused. I'm not confused, but pleasantly surprised I think would be the best um, phrase to use because you know I thought he was going to be ridiculously garbage but it's, but he actually did better than I thought so that's going to wrap this up guys and honestly of course he should not be your starting quarterback I feel he can win you games but just like Michael Vick I feel like he'll also be the reason you lose a few games so he should not be your starting quarterback he has his uses if you want to use him like you know as a fake field goal quarterback you know to run with it or even like uh, like if you're in the red zone, you want to come on a five wide or QB draw or just the uh, the, the uh, Panthers playbook with all those QB runs. I can understand that, but he should not be your your starting quarterback. But he was fun to play with. That's that's for sure. But um, anyways, guys, my next review is going to be the, the uh, night guarding Mac and Collins. Now, see you boys then. Peace.